Hello and good evening to everybody. I know I just say no, it's just by being talking about this. What I'm just on to tonight is Woody's Roundup. Because of they already did Woody's Roundup in in Toy Story 2 in year 1999 and 2000. That's why I was being stunned to know how I did my own replica to these four of these. Like Al, he did used to steal from Toy Story 2. Like he used to take, used to swipe in a yard sale, and he did not want to let 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 Al have 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 Andy's uh, doll because of. I know why he was feeling over feeling like he wanted to have it, but he did push the skateboard over and smashed everything until he stole Woody and then ran away. He did. He tried to put it in the display cabinets. He did. So my guy, I've got the same too. If you want to have a look at my collections of Woody, I'll show you. Now this is my replica Woody. I've put him in a display glass, and look, he looks beautiful. He looks quite the same Acre Woody doll from Toy Story, like Andy had him in a movie. Now this. I've replicated the face, I know I've already did a good job, like, doing things, like, he's got a sheriff badge, and a buckle belt, spurs, and that's why he's starting to know, like, he's got himself a tiny, tiny plastic ring on his back, with a pole string. This is how he, he always looked like he turns to be, like, a, a greatest original doll from the 50s, Woody. And I've got all the all the get roundup gangs too. Here is Stinky Pete. I've replicated Stinky Pete because of the doll of Stinky Pete's didn't exist in real life. It's like kids didn't really want fancy having Stinky Pete because he was a villain in Toy Story Two when he was on Woody's Roundup. You can see. That's why it's just a. Uh, he already has got a golden tuff, and these brown eyes seem like Woody, and a bald head. You can see how we, I did all things, like a pickaxe. I've replicated the pickaxe to this, what I've just already just did. Uh, it was really, really intelligent, like it's made it into a figure, like I've me figured it with, with a lot of clay things and built it things. Now this is how what he has a pickaxe. Like he he didn't want to let Woody go because of because what happened is Woody wanted to get back with 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 Buzz Lightyear because of he didn't because of he did sit Woody with the arm he did until he learned his lesson in Toy Story two. But he's the one who used to be the one he was in towards to the cave when they were stuck with a dynamite. They'd be blown up to smithereens until Jesse wanted to get the critters to go get Woody to for call help. This is how he always be the prospector. That's why he's just only original doll. And he can still talk, he, ta he can. Because I replicated him while I've me just got him in collection. And he is Jesse. I've replicated actually this is Jesse from Toy Story 2 because of this is how she always be the yelling cowgirl and she really used to love for critters like she catches them with a lasso rope. That's why she always tries to be the one when she used to be she was really the greatest super cowgirl. The one she always likes to yodel when she always call for help she does. Because of the time is just I know why I did is just have she's got a tiny plastic ring. I did him did her too. And that's why it's just so she has got boots too. You can see the boots. That's how it's been shown from for these time. And she's got a cowgirl red and white hat and green eyes red hair now this is why she always used to be the one who is the only the superless cowgirl why she yodels 
That's why I'm so lucky, why I've collected all the Toy Stories of Woody's Roundup, four of them. And this, this is Bullseye. The only greatest horse. I know why I've just started to think how amazing he, he, he's Woody's horse. That's why he neighs and he really likes to go ride like the wind, Bullseye. That's why he ri rides on Bullseye when <coughs> he gets towards to be the superhero because of he likes picking all the horse shoes when he always likes to throw towards to the loop thing. He's got the hooves, you can see on the bottom by there. That's why he's just sort of, uh, I know why I've got them all inside display cabinets. You can see these. Because of this Woody's Roundups collections, what I've already did, start to know why I've replicated these, what I've he just went to pay all good monies to collect all the Toy Stories. I've done Woody's Roundup to four of them. Now this is how it's just I'm starting to feel lucky. I know I did my own collections of Woody's Roundups. So what did you think, everybody? I, I've starting to know why I'm just starting to feel lucky. I know I've been congratulated to be... To be selling all the collections of Woody's of Toy Stories, like I've done Woody in display cabinets. I know it's like from Toy Story Two. Al did the same to collect these four of them inside. He did. This is how he always used to be the one who want to put them into Japan museums. Because I don't really need to have to do that. Because I'm okay about that. I want me to show you all of these figures too in the cabinets. Watch this. And these are all of my figures. This is Stinky Pete, Prospector, Woody above Wall's Eye, Jesse. These are my figures too. I've collected these Woody's Roundups. And that's why I've just started to feel being such a luckiest boy. And I know I'm just really, 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 really... So happy, I know I've just already did everything, so I did all the good things, like I've, like I, like, I did, do, did, do, do recording voice box buying things online, so like I do voice acting, so like I've, I've done that for Sticky P, and that's how he, he's become to be the accurate from Toy Story 2. And thank you for looking my Woody's Roundup dolls in cabinets. Hope, hope you all. Take care and wishes your good lucks to you, old friends and people on Facebook. And thank you very much and good luck.